Supergirl. So lay on your stomach and stretch out and then lift up. Okay, and she wants to put her head in a little bit. Put your head in a little bit more. Squeeze your legs together. Pretty good. Head up though. Okay, so we don't want it down, we don't want it back, we want it neutral. That's good. You gotta keep your legs together. Alright. I want you to do the roll. I can't do the roll. Try the roll. Okay. <laughs> this is very hard for Follow, me. Follow, arch, follow. Together. Pretty good. Oh, and then it's <laughs> Okay. I, Hold on. Do one more. Okay. okay. Stay hollow and Make keep, it a little closer, Scott. Keep it going. Okay. So keep it going. You're stopping in your arch. Okay. So hollow when you roll over to the arch. Oh, arch, keep going. Pretty <laughs> good, but you're trying to move all the pieces separately. Okay, handstand is the most important skill in gymnastics. Almost all other skills go through a handstand. Okay, so remember we want to start in a stretch, arms way up by the ears, okay, and lift your back leg up. Don't start with the hands, then the back leg. Okay. This is very hard. <laughs> when you're my age, this is hard, but it's fun. <laughs> Pretty good. Drive the back leg up. You're reaching with the hands a little bit. Okay. Really push it down the floor. A lot better. I've been doing this for, I've been in gymnastics 30 years. And there's no one your age who can do this. You may have to talk to Guinness. All right, you ready? All right. Keep climbing. Keep climbing. <laughs> you ready? Yep. Today. Yes. Get it? Get that hundred dollars that was up there. Down slow. Good control. Let's keep going. I'm Bob Hooray! Patton and I'm a master swimmer. I've been a member at the Denver Athletic Club since 1958 and I've known Heidi for at least the last 16, 20 years, and she's continued to work at her goals and achieve those over the years, and has become a very top person in the fitness program. So Heidi is one that uh, has a lot of energy and has always shown that uh, to everyone. Straight arms, straight. Now lift your knees up. Uh, yes. Aha. Okay, Pike. Pike. Good. Really hard. I don't yes, think sir. I can do it today. Straddle. Yes. Okay. Very good. Excellent. <laughs> All right. That's hard. You know, I haven't known Heidi that long, but Heidi is truly such a remarkable individual. She resonates at such an extremely high energy frequency that whatever she does to stay fit and well, we have to copy. Or, you can seat start. War. We're not gonna have a seat No seat war today. <laughs> but I would win. I love the trampoline. It makes you feel like a 10 year old. <laughs> okay, instructor, what do I do? All right, we're warming up. Bounce a little bit. Oh, we're warming up? Yeah, okay. just a little bit. Bounce. I told you this is a trip. Do something fun. Oh well. Do, do the thing that you do against the wall for Tyrone. Re Scotty. Request. Okay. Yeah. I want to request. All Watch right. this, gang. Spinning Spider-Man. Isn't that cool? Hi, I'm Terry Nelson. I am the athletic director of the Denver Athletic Club, and I've known Heidi Borsler for almost 20 years, and. I'm here to say that she is a true inspiration to all of our members, athletes and non-athletes. She's been our Athlete of the Year as a female, and then as she passed the age of 50 as our Master Female Athlete of the Year. Uh, when I first met her, she was a swimmer, a very serious swimmer, and then she got very serious into yoga and has competed many times in competitions and knows everybody at the club, and she truly is an inspiration for, for our athletes and non-athletes alike. Hi, I'm Don Cook. I'm a member of the DAC. We've done yoga together for about 15 years, and she is an inspiration. 
Um, even though she is a lawyer, I still think highly of her. I'm Steve Hutchins. Uh, I've known Heidi for 20 years. Uh, Heidi is a very inspirational per person. Uh, she takes good care of a disabled daughter. Uh, she's been a law professor at uh, Colorado University. I think she's a Yale graduate. Uh, and if it's Princeton, she'll get really mad at me for saying that. Uh, she was a nationally ranked uh, swimmer before she decided to uh, embark on her bodybuilding uh, career. Heidi is one of those people that uh, whenever she decides to do something, she does it 110%. And Hi, I'm Scott Nolte. I just wanted to say that I've known Heidi Bursler for a long time. She's a wonderful friend. She's a true inspiration, and you'll notice that among all the other attributes, and the most outstanding, is her terrific personality and the way she looks forward to every day. And that's a great inspiration to everyone. I think that's a great inspiration at any age, especially over 50. Thanks, Heidi, very much. This is my dear friend, Dennis Gallagher. He's the city auditor of Denver. Well, I'm honored that Heidi would come and visit me here in the office. And I just want to let you know she is an inspiration. Yeah, some years ago she told me I better start exercising and watching my diet in order that I survive to see my son walk down the aisle. So that's what I'm doing. I've lost 50 pounds under her inspiration. I walk the stairs every day. I try to, don't do it every day. I go up to the 12th, back down to the 1st, and then up to the 7th. So that's my story, and I think we have an ethical obligation to try to make sure that our employees and ourselves are in the best shape that we can be. I'm going to go to the 